This is why. This is why. Alright. Alright, I get it. I get it. Jesus Christ, I suck. I'm too used to playing like Gandhi. I'm too used to non-violence. That's what this game's fucking done to me. Look what you've done to me, game! You- you broke me! <laughs> I used to be so good at killing. Godlike! <laughs> What's up guys, Godlike Man, we're back, continuing The Consequence, this is part 4, and uh, I was gonna stop recording today, uh, that was the original plan, cause I had already recorded 3 parts today, and it's already, like it's midnight right now, um, I recorded the 3 parts within the span of like an hour, and then I've just spent the rest of my time editing them and uploading them. So they're they're going up right now. I'm in the process of doing that. But uh I had no plans tonight and honestly I'm really bored, so I I was like, you know what? I'm gonna keep playing, whatever. I'll just keep playing. Cause why not? I need something to do. And honestly, like this area we're in on on the, the consequence, like, this reminds me of uh chapter eleven. In, in the main game, because in chapter 11, from there on, you start being in the city. Which is cool. Because I, I like the atmosphere of it all, and I always thought that area was really cool. And uh, now we're in a very similar area, so... It's, um... I like it. Gives me motivation to play. Oh, are you fucking serious? Oh, it's so... <laughs> Little bitch! Well, he's See you at the back. bottom. Oh, nice one, Kidman. Well, see you at the bottom. <laughs> I bet you feel cool. What a cool kid. Get it? Because their name's Kid. Kidman. Yeah! I still really hope that, um... God, I just sounded like a fucking sheep laughing. That was not my intent. Uh... Oh, this is so cool. We get to, like, sneak up behind guys and fucking body check them off the goddamn building. How fucking cool is that? How do we get across? Oh, there's a walkway. But, um... I was immediately talking about something, and then I instantly forgot what I was talking about. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. Wrong place, the wrong time, baby. Oh! <laughs> so this looks like it's literally just to hide from enemies. Oh, sweetness. Yummy. I'll take that. Thank you. Alrighty. So now we got ourselves a murder weapon. It was Kidman on the building rooftop. With the axe. Aw, oh, dude. Watch this. Watch this. This is gonna be some sick shit. Ready? MLG. Over here. Fuck. <laughs> his, his, his ear holes don't reach this far, apparently. Hey! Come check it out, fool! Oh, you heard something, didn't you? Oh, he definitely heard something. But you know what he didn't hear? Me almost getting spotted. Oh, fuck, what is he doing, you piece of shit? Oh, God, I love that. So satisfying. There's just something so satisfying about destroying the cranium of your enemies. Like, absolutely just annihilating it. I think the game that does it the absolute best is RE4. There's just something so great about Ganados when their heads explode. Like, my absolute favorite thing to do in that game, hands down, my absolute favorite way to kill an enemy in RE4 is um, suplexing them and, and, and having their head blow up from the suplex. 
It's the most amazing, beautiful thing in, in video games. It's fucking incredible. Hey, look, beacon! Hey, <laughs> Um, but yeah, what sucks is you can only do it on the castle dudes. Uh, oh, and the, and the army dudes, actually. You could do it on them, too. Just not the guys at the beginning, not the villagers. Uh, why they chose to go about it like that, I do not know. Check it out. Jeez, I almost didn't even see that. Didn't even really look like a collectible at first. But yeah, I don't know. I, I really like this uh, setting in Evil Within. I, I don't know why I like it so much. Normally, I'm much more of a fan of the dark corridors and the eerie hallways and stuff like that. But I, I don't know what it was. But in the Evil Within, uh, Chapter 11 and on, I, I thought were really fun and really cool for some reason. I just really liked it. So we got a code here, which means there's got to be something on the wall. A hint of some sort. Something. Anything. Okay. Doesn't seem to be anything. Oh, it's one of these ones where you turn on all the colors. These are fun. Oh, you have a limited amount of moves. Interesting. So, I'm thinking maybe we could go like that. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> this is cool, though. This reminds me of Onimusha. I don't know if you guys ever played those games. They're kind of ancient, but um, I love them. I think they're fucking great. And uh, yeah, there was there were these really fun, challenging puzzles all throughout the game. Every treasure chest, which had kick-ass stuff in them all the time, uh, they they had they they came with like a puzzle for you to solve. And they were always really challenging and quite fun, actually. Jesus fucking Christ, I don't know what I'm doing. God damn it. I will cut back when I figure this shit out. Fucking got him! I'm more talented than I thought. I was gonna fucking edit it, but I did it so fast that there's no point. God, I am so fucking talented. Who knew? Um, god damn, I, I fucking can't wait for me to man and Smash Bros. I really want to play some Smash Bros. But I really want Mewtwo. I may or may not even be able to get him, and if I can't get him, that's gonna suck. Um, I'm really hoping that the Nintendo store accepts my debit card. Otherwise, I won't be able to get them because, um, I was gonna use PayPal originally, but I didn't realize. I Fuck. But I am thankful. I don't know what would have happened to me if you hadn't brought me in. Okay, sorry, sorry about that. I didn't want to talk over the fucking cutscene, mm -hmm. but it just... Looks like it might be my only way out. It abruptly came out of nowhere, kind of like that one just did. But anyways, um, yeah, I was saying I was originally going to buy Mewtwo with PayPal, but I didn't realize that I have no money in my PayPal account because I just recently transferred it into my bank account because I needed to pay off some debt. And yeah, so now I don't have any money right now in my PayPal account. Oh, you just pop them on there. So we got to go on an adventure find some fucking stuff and stuff that's the joke there's another one so what's the catch this looks too easy it's gotta be some sort of catch what do you got for me game what's the challenge so you hide in these right yeah you do so an enemy's probably gonna bust out of nowhere watch 
What did I say? He literally busted out of nowhere, just like I said he would. Or she. It could be a femme bitch. Dude, what if I just sneak up like a goddamn G? Oh fuck, I almost got spotted. That was very close. <laughs> Alright. Well, this is a lot easier than I thought it would be. Come on, bitch, move. Yeah, yeah, trick. Wait, what am I doing? I should probably go forward because there's nothing back. You know what? I'm just gonna go, like, pop this on. It'll probably checkpoint me if I do. Okay. Confusing. That was strange. So wait, is, was that all I needed? Oh, shit. Serious? Oh! I thought I would have needed more pieces than that. So wait, what did I miss back there? What was in the yellow door? Like, the way she came from. Was there anything in there? Oh, fuck. There's a room in there. What if I missed something? There you go. There you go. Alright, so what's in here? Really? Nothing? Well, shit. Sorry about that, guys, but I fucking had to know, okay? I had to know what was in there. This is your last chance to prove yourself to us, kid. Don't let us down. Bring the boy to us. Stop it! Get out of my head! I mean, it's pretty clear that, you know, Kidman's not gonna do that. And, uh, you know, because why would she just willingly hand him over when clearly Mobius has got something fishy up their sleeves? How do you kick down doors? There you go. Whoa, look at this shit. This is fancy. Fuck. Fucking grand fucking piano and shit. Alright, that's a weird picture, but cool. Oh, dude, save point. You know it. You know. <laughs> Cats. Yeah, that's right. All right. I immediately forgot. I think we had like seven minutes left, roughly. Something like that. I can't fucking remember. All right, kid. That's enough nonsense. It looks incredibly cute, but, but, you know. Come on, this isn't the time or the place. Your time could be better spent. I mean, we got, let, let's, let's be real here. Let's be honest. So, I mean, like, yeah, I mean, like, look at this place. What's not to like? Sebastian. Oh, Enjoy. awesome. I dragged you into this. What have I done? Dude. That's me. That's fucking me. Going through a Kumu mode. At that part. <laughs> Who am I kidding? Yeah, fucking right. Not with a pistol. Not with a fucking handgun. No, he didn't. Not only is the accuracy bullshit on that gun. But you can't do that part on a Kumu mode without ice bolts. I guarantee it. And if you can, you're a god. Because... Christ almighty. That part was hard! Hey, this is the room where he goes on the tram and... slowly goes across. That's cool. Oh, shizzle. Is he supposed to detect me like that? Interesting. 
Oh shit, I just stood right next to a fucking flame canister. That wasn't very smart. Uh, I'm gonna assume that dude's dead. For good measure. Oh, no fucking way. A gun? Oh, hey, hang on, hang on. I, I almost can't even believe it. I have a fucking gun. No fucking way. This can't be real. Dude. Okay. I'm gonna show... I'm gonna action movie this bitch. Yeah. So hopefully the pistol, this pistol, isn't nearly as bad as, as uh, Sebastian's. I am so fucking happy that we have a gun. Like, how cool is that? Come on. Maximum ammo conservation, baby. Watch this. Watch this. Are you watching? Oh! That's right. So she always holds her gun up like that? Like, real? Is that necessary, Kidman? You just want to look cool? Is that it? Alright. I mean, I guess. Like, you know. I guess you deserve it. Why not? So where do we go now? Oh, this way. Cool. Cool beans. Aw, oh, give me that. Yeah. Dude, we have a fucking gun and we're picking up ammo. Suddenly it feels it feels right at home with the evil within. God damn. Oh boy. Oh god, I just created a fucking bridge. You boys want some yeet. 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 Uh. Dude, we can actually fucking fight now. Like how cool is that? Ow. You fuck. No! Damn it! Okay, well I'm not I'm not I'm not as uh as potent as Sebastian, that much is clear. <laughs> when Sebastian punches people, it's like ye can punch him for days and and he's just like a boxer, like going all around him, they can't even touch him. But with me that's not the case, sadly. Alright. Let's see what we got here, let's see. Let's see. Fuck, that wasn't good. Oh, well that worked out. Damn. Alright, let's go grab that ammo we couldn't carry. Like that. And we're good. Holy shit, guys. Like, I'm still s fucking in awe that we're fighting with, with weapons. This is amazing! Hallelujah! Praise the Lord, we have guns! Okay, see I heard him and then I almost didn't believe it and... Ah, shit, no! Are you kidding me? It's that easy? For them to kill- mm. Okay, I'm underestimating these dudes. Now that I have a gun, I, f I feel too power hungry. <laughs> and uh... And now I'm getting shit on. God damn it! Alright, Matt. Smart enough. Play it straight. Just play it straight. You can do this. You can do this, boy. Self-motivation. That's how we do. Alright. So the key... I mean, what can I say? God... Damn it. I... Oh my... <laughs> I hate shit. Holy fuck. This is hard. I mean, two shots per guy hitting them in the head. And, uh, I mean, I'm assuming it's two shots in the head. It might be more if I wasn't hitting them in the head. And I don't want to test it because, uh, fucking, that's how it's always been, man. Like, headshots do more damage in their story. See, this is, like, look at that. Look at that! I- he's running at me and I just keep missing forever, which is why, like, oh my- This is why, this is why. Alright. Alright, I get it. I get it. Jesus Christ, I suck. I'm too used to playing like Gandhi. 
I'm too used to non-violence. That's what this game's fucking done to me. Look what you've done to me, game! You- you broke me! <laughs> I used to be so good at killing. Let me check the time. Alright, we're actually at our limit, but I really don't want to give up. Like, I, I gotta beat this. I'm not gonna stop until I do. When they're running at you, it's impossible to hit them! Except when they're... when it's not. Oh, okay, that was cool. Alright, alright. Good stuff. And we just gotta beat the second wave. Is that it? Okay. Alright. Come on, ass hat. That was supposed to be one shot for the fucking barrel, but... Yeah, I guess not. <sighs> I really wanted to hit him in the fucking head, but... When they're running at you, it's like fucking possible. No, not this time. You can just sit there and fucking die. Jesus Christ, if I had to die there... That would have been pretty fucking bad. Alright, so now I gotta listen to Kidman pant for the next 24 hours. More ammo. Good stuff. Come on, kid. Get your health back. I see more ammo down there. I'm gonna go get it. Am I being chased? Could have sworn I heard enemies. Alright. Let's go. Uh, shit. I really should be ending the park because we're over. I guess I should. Well, thank you guys for watching, and uh, I will see you in the next part.